Hi everyone, it's Marisa. Welcome back to my channel, Wet Paint Contemporary. How is everyone today? And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. So before we get started, I'm going to be doing a project share and a craft haul today. But before we get started, I just wanted to announce, now I had an art auction which ended the 29th of May. And I just wanted to announce who won the painting. And if you want to see me actually make this painting, I'm sorry, it's already wrapped up, ready to go. Um, it is my swipe for ch uh, swipe right for charity and the person that created this charity was Stacy Nicole from Artsy Fartsy Lovers and she actually won the painting as well so thank you Stacy so so much for creating this charity uh, coming up with the idea and I am happy that you won the painting as well. I'm going to buy some food for my local food banks or find a charity around here. There's quite a few that I found. So I just want to thank you so much for um, just the idea and your kind heart. And yeah, I'm just really, you know, I'm really excited. Um, this, this was my first art auction. So yeah, that is my announcement. So uh, let's get on with the project share is first and then the craft haul. Alrighty. Hey guys. So let's start with the project share. Now, I understand that, you know, I started this channel um, doing like paint pouring and then maybe three, four months ago, I started with resin art. And then I started watching a lot of craft channels um, and I just got really inspired. So I wanted to kind of like broaden my skill set as an artist and really kind of branch out a little bit. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be, do I'm not going to be doing tutorials yet with uh, paper crafts until I get more comfortable. So right now I'm going to do, you know, some project shares and some hauls and until I get more comfortable, then I will do some tutorials. But I just want to give a big, big shout out to Gina from Gina Loves to Craft because she is the channel and the person, the human being that um, really inspired me to actually start even getting into paper crafts at all so hey Gina thank you so much um, just for always supporting my channel I know I support you too but thank you for being an inspiration for me to even get started and I have a really big haul with craft stuff you know I'm new at this I'm a newbie um, yeah so let's get started um, this is, um, actually there's a few birthdays coming up. So this card I made for my son, obviously. And this is the card I made. I got special stickers, um, just for him. And so that's the answer. He likes to play soccer and number one son. So yeah, that is his card birthday card I didn't obviously fill it out yet um, so that is that I really love this paper uh, this is a Father's Day card for my hubby and I got him special stickers and this paper is just gorgeous and I um, got special scissors to just do the edging edging here and that is his card. A little shaving cream and a little spot to put uh, a message. No, dead. And then the back is family. So that is that one. This is just the envelope I made. This is like the second one I've ever made. So I love this paper. And this big guy over here. Now, I don't want to open this up. There's a, there's a couple of cards in here. And this is for Stacy Nicole. There's two big cards in here. Um, I don't want to spoil the surprise for her. But this is the envelope with some bling on it. Uh, this is special paper I bought. Um, it's like spray paint, like graffiti paper. So I thought that was kind of cool, like a New York Edge. And I can't show you the 
um, the cards. I don't want to spoil the surprise because maybe she'll watch this video. She usually watches my videos. But this is the big envelope I made for her cards in here. Now this... Um, this is called a loaded bag. And I just saw a, a tutorial. And the name of the channel, I just started following her literally yesterday. Uh, the day before yesterday. Uh, the name of the channel is Ginny, Jimmy Lanny Creations, and I'll link her channel below. But this is called a loaded bag, and I have to say I'm impressed with myself for making this because... And by the way, Gina, I made you one. It's in this package here. So you have quite a few things in there. So this is for my husband's birthday. So I made him a card, and it fits in here. So I'll just show you the bag first. And I did these little to make a pocket. And yeah, so I put this here so I can put a message. And then I'm trying to make it a little more masculine. So I use the sticker. And then of course, I'm gonna put something inside the bag. And then the card for him is gonna go in there. So I try to make it as masculine as possible. A lot, most of my papers are very feminine. So, yes. So I did not have any birthday paper. So I tried to uh, use um, like motivational stickers and sayings instead. So just love your life. Keep chasing your dreams. Uh, be yourself, be amazing. And I made a little pocket here. And then a little mini card is going to go in there. And oh, yeah, I forgot about that. And that is like a Father's Day sticker, but I thought that was like more masculine. And I put that on the back. So that is my husband's card. I'm really, really happy with the way this came out. I'm kind of. I, I saw this tutorial from uh, Jimmy Lonnie's um, Creations channel, and I said, you know what, maybe I could do that. And I tried it, and I did it. So I'm really happy with it. Yeah, so I'm gonna um, link Gina's channel in the, in the description below. I'm gonna link uh, Jimmy Lonnie Creations channel, and I almost forgot I am going to link uh, Stacey Nicole's channel from RT Farty Lovers as well. And Gina, I'm gonna be putting this in the mail very soon, uh, maybe tomorrow, the next day, but this is going in the mail, and you get a, quite a few things in here, okay? All right, so up next is my haul. I'm really excited, guys. Okay, I'll be right back. Hey, guys, I am back. So this is a huge, huge craft haul, and there is more coming, okay? I got some stuff from Gina, from Gina Loves the Craft. I got tons of paper. Now, mind you, all of this was on sale, okay? All of it. Um, I got a, a big thing of scissors. These scissors are okay. Uh, they don't work great, but I got these from Michael's. It was like $12 or something. Um, let's start over here because this is an Amazon Hobby Lobby. I just found Hobby Lobby. It's crazy. Um, and Michael's Hall. All right. So these beautiful papers are from Amazon. I've been looking at these papers forever, for like months and months and months, and they were pretty expensive, but um, this is by Stamperia. So these are just beautiful papers. I think it opens up this way. Yeah, this is just gorgeous. There's a lot of paper, so I'm not going to flip through every page, because then this video will be an hour long. And then this one by Stamperia as well. Um, let's see. Yeah, these papers are absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Yeah, these were much cheaper than I usually see them for. That's why I bought them. And these were all from Michaels. Some sea glass paper. Very pretty. And this is the sweet water. There we go. Yeah, this is beautiful. This is what got me started. The paper pads just got me going crazy. 
This is one of my favorites. Sweet Ambrosia is just, uh, that's actually what I use to make some of the cards for my husband and my son. I try to find, you know, papers that were a little more masculine, but that was kind of hard. So these are just beautiful. And then the Dream Chaser. I actually ordered this before, but someone stole it from my building. Thank you so much. <laughs> but uh, these were, these are so gorgeous. Look at that. And I used some of it already. I couldn't help it. All right, so that is Michael's. And then, let's come over here. So that's from Michael's as well. I got these from Gina. I got my first dies. I'm so happy. I can't use this yet because I didn't realize how tiny this was. But I can use most of these. Yeah, this one is a little too big as well. But I used this already. So these are really cool dies I got from Gina. Um, yeah, so then a couple came with the machine. I got my first die cut machine, and of course it came with the pads and all that, and it came with a little, uh, I can't get it out, but it's all right. Um, back here is a little embossing folder, so that is that. I got this little guy so I could put my dies in here, and then I have the um, pads in there stored so and I got this for 40% off so everything was very much on sale um, and then on Gina's rec uh, recommendation she did a review on this and I said you know this is perfect for me because I can't keep anything straight and this is magnetic uh, uh, let's see yeah so this is cool I love this this just came yesterday, and this holds the uh, paper down with the magnets. I love that. As soon as she reviewed it, I was like, "I this is perfect for me because I can't do anything. <laughs> I can't cut a straight line. And these all from Hobby Lobby. All this is from Hobby Lobby. Uh, yeah, I think all of it's for Hobby Lobby. Anyway, so this, these were all half off. What is this? Hello Lovely, I believe. Yes, the Hello Lovely paper crafting kit. Um, this was originally $10. I got it for five. And then I, I this is so cool. All the stickers. I said this is really perfect for me because since I'm just starting, it gives me a little bit of everything here. And then I got the Mermaid Dreams kit again. Originally ten dollar or eight dollars whatever i got it for five so and then i got some extra stuff as well i don't know i think this all came together but it came with so many beautiful things mermaid stuff let's be mermaids and then it came with these so pretty and then it came with these beautiful stickers I used some already, as you can see. <laughs> and then I got a Mermaid Dreams paper pad. And Stacy, I definitely made you a card using this paper. So, wow, this is so gorgeous. Yeah, so I have some more things coming. And I will show that to you in another video. Yeah, yeah, this paper is just amazing. Look at that, just gorgeous. Yeah, so that is my, pa oh, my paper haul. That is my craft haul. So yeah, um, like I said, you know, I am absolutely gonna continue painting. I'm gonna continue doing resin art. And I am going to, I've already started my paper crafting and I'm just, it's just very enjoyable for me. And like I said, I just love to add to my skill set as an artist, just being creative. And yeah, I just love doing this. So I think this is, this paper just makes me so happy. Anyway, so I'm really excited. 
um, to show you what I'm going to make with this in the future. And like I said, once I get more comfortable, maybe I'll do some tutorials. Um, yeah, so that is it for today, guys. I just want to share that with you. I hope you enjoy. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss one of my videos. And all my social media links are below. And yeah, I will see you in the next one, guys. Bye. Hope you enjoyed.